Let's start in child's pose with your knees wide and big toes touching. Release your hips back and down and stretch your arms in front. Begin to arrive as you slowly deepen your breath. Pull each inhale down deep into the belly, and then with each exhale, melt a little heavier into your mat. Baby camel, roll up, walk the hands back and inhale, lift your hips high. Roll the shoulders back and down away from the ears, maybe let your head gently hang back. Lower the hips, bring the hands forward for tabletop, align shoulders over wrists and hips over knees. Inhale, cow pose. Let the belly drop and the heart lift high as the tail goes high. And exhale, cat pose. Scoop the tail under and draw your chin to your chest. Inhale, cow. Shoulder blades pull together. Heart reaches through. Exhale, cat. Puff up the upper back. Take a few more rounds on your own. Come back to a neutral spine. Extend your right leg out wide to the side. Press the edge of the right foot down. Breathe in. Then rise up, arms out to a T. Then let your right hand slowly come down to your right thigh or shin. Stretch your left arm overhead. Breathe out, stretch right. Stretch through the left arm. Feel the opening in your left side body. Rise back up, then lower the hands down. Press the edge of the right foot down. Breathe in. Ease the hips back. Breath out. Keep the spine long. Feel the inner thigh and the hamstrings lengthen. Come back to tabletop. Puppy dog pose. Walk the hands forward and melt the chest toward the mat. Feel the shoulders open. Slowly rise back up to tabletop. Other side. Left leg out wide to the side. Anchor through the outside edge of the foot. Inhale. Then rise up, arms out to a T. Then lower your left hand towards the left thigh or calf. Right arm reaches overhead. Breathe out. Stretch left. Maybe the left hand reaches lower down on the leg as you tilt even more to the left. Rise back up, then lower the hands down. Anchor through the outside edge of the foot. Inhale. Hips back, breath out. Keep anchoring the outside edge of the left foot down as you stretch the inner thigh.
lower the knee back to the mat. Now come to a kneeling position. Then place your hands like you're putting them in back pockets for camel pose. Breathe in, reach the sternum up. Breathe out, lean back and ease your hips forward, open the throat. Stay here, or maybe walk the hands down to your ankles. Roll the shoulders back and down. Let the throat fall back and down. Press through the hips and inhale, start to rise back up. Then have a seat on your heels. Take one more camel pose on your own. Inhale, come back up. Exhale, back to child's pose. Send breath down into the hips. Start to rise, then make your way onto your back. Bridge pose. Step your feet back to touch your middle fingers and separate your feet hip width distance. Then root down through your inner feet. Then start to push your hips up to the sky, slowly peeling your spine off the mat, all the way through the mid back and the upper back. Wiggle your arms underneath you and interlace your hands together. With each in breath, Feel the expansion of the chest and the rib cage. Exhale, release. Let the hands go wide. Let the hips come down. Flip the palms to the mat and find bridge pose again. Hips high. Stay lifted and rise high onto the balls of your feet. Lift the heels. Hips still high. Lower and lift the heels a few times. Keep the hips lifted even as you stretch the heels down toward the mat. The next time your heels are up, Pause. Lower the heels back to the mat and then slowly lower the hips all the way down. Now take the feet out wide to the edges of your mat and let the knees come together. Then slowly windshield wiper the legs side to side. Just let the lower back release. Then find stillness. Draw your knees into your chest. Give them a squeeze. Grab behind your hamstrings and rock yourself all the way up. Then make your way down onto your belly. Right shoulder peels off the mat for cobra twist. Take your gaze right. Feel the right mid-back engage to help you twist even more to the right. Release down completely. Cobra twist left side. Peel the left shoulder up. Gaze left. Press the tops of both feet down into the mat as you twist. Exhale, release back down. Sphinx pose. Walk your hands forward and prop yourself up onto your forearms. Elbows gently pull back on the mat as the chest starts to open.
soften all the way down, arms by your sides. Turn the chin to the right. Slowly bring the hands by your shoulders. Push up to tabletop. Align shoulders over wrists, hips over knees. Set up the corkscrew. Walk your hands a few inches forward, then step your right foot to the outside edge of your right hand. Reach your right arm back and capture your back foot. Take slow breaths as you open the front side of your back thigh. Release the back foot, back leg long. Find pigeon, heel toe your right foot over to the left and lay the shin down. Take a deep breath in here. Exhale, fold and release completely. Release your head down and just melt into the floor beneath you. Rise back up. Now move to half Hanuman. Firm your hands into the mat and straighten the right leg out long in front of you. Hips way back. Inhale. Let the spine grow long. Exhale as you fold. Bend the front knee if you need to here and send breath into the back of the right hamstring. Come back up. Half frog. Walk your hands forward a bit. Then lay your right shin down so that it lines up with the right edge of your mat. Let the right shin slide out to the side as you lower down onto your belly. Toes of the right foot point to the right. Turn your chin to the right. Feel the hips begin to open. Maybe a slight stretch in the right groin. Press yourself back up to tabletop. Prep for corkscrew. Hands forward, left foot steps up and out wide. Reach your left arm up and back and take hold of the back foot. Feel the opening in your right hip flexor. Now let the foot go, back leg long. Find pigeon, heel toe the left foot over to the right. Take a deep breath in, exhale, fold. Just soften here, release your shoulders, release your neck, completely relax your thighs.
start to rise. Move to half Hanuman. Ground the hands down and lengthen your left leg in front of you. Breath in. Keep the spine long. And fold. Exhale. If the hamstrings are tight, bend the front knee as much as you need to here. Slowly rise up. Half frog. Walk the hands forward a little and lay the left shin down along the left edge of your mat. Then slide down onto your belly. Toes of the left foot point left. Invite the body to become heavy, releasing down into the support of your mat. From here, sweep your left leg long behind you, hands by shoulders. Press yourself up, then make your way onto your back. Draw your right knee into your chest, left leg long. Exhale, take the knee to the left. Extend your right arm to the right and gaze right. Just settle in here and let everything be heavy. Slowly unwind. Other side now, left knee up, right leg long. Exhale, drape the left knee across your body. Send the left arm out to the side, gaze left. Maybe bring right hand to left knee. Gently unwind, then pull both knees up close to your chest. Take one last inhale. Exhale, Shavasana. Lay the legs long. Let the arms come down by the hips. Turn the palms up and settle in. Stay for as much time as you'd like here. Thank you for sharing your practice with us.